curly hair that I posted a picture of on Instagram and Twitter and you guys were like, oh my god, do a tutorial. So I actually got the Numi curling wand in the size 19 millimeters. Um, when I was ordering mine, I was trying to look on YouTube to see what kind of curls I would get, but no one had the 19 millimeters. So I figured I would do um, my hair with this to show you guys just in case any of you guys want to get the 19. And yeah. So let's get started. Oh, and by the way, I got the nice zebra print. You see that? It looks sexy. Okay, so I already plugged in my um, Numi curling wand, and here's the on button. So we're gonna put that on. Uh, by the way, I just showered. Um, my hair is just, it's dry already, but um, yeah, you need your, your hair to be dry if you're gonna be doing this. You don't wanna burn your hair off because the heat is like really strong. So, by the way, this is a mirror, just in case you guys see me in here, and I have a mirror right there, so if I'm looking to that side when I'm curling, that's why, because there's a mirror over there and over here. So, I'm going to section my hair off, and just have, like, the bottom pieces first. I'm going to just twirl that, and I create, like, a little loop thingy, and you're going to clip that, just like that. So now we have this whole section of hair right over here. The Numi curling wands also come with this um, glove so you don't burn yourself and it says Numi obviously because it's a product of theirs. I'm going to put on my right hand because that's the hand I twirl my stuff with, my hair with, <laughs> my stuff. I'm going to take a curling wand, it's already heated up, it heats up really fast and you're just going to take a section of the bigger the section of hair the thicker the curl is gonna be and I just go like that and you twirl it around and there's our first curl if you guys could see that see it it's so beautiful and then you're gonna just keep grabbing sections of hair so here's our second piece you're gonna put the curling one under it and twirl around. Now since we got to this side already, so you could see back here, or kind of, but now we're going to start on the side. So this is the side we're going to do now. And I'm going to start from the back because as I do each piece, I put it on the other side so I don't get confused. Except for this side, I switch my glove because now I do the other hand. A section of hair. And twirl it. See, now we have this curl and we're going to put it on the other side. Okay, so now we're done with that. See how that looks? It's so pretty. Okay, so we're gonna grab the next section of hair and you're gonna put it all to one side. You don't wanna get it confused with the hair that you already did. I'm gonna start with the most back piece and since this hair falls on this side, I'm gonna curl it on this side. Okay, now we have this side, and I gotta switch my gloves again. Start with the piece that's farther in the back.
So now we're done with our second layer of hair. See, this is what it's looking like so far. Now we're going to take another section, move all this hair from to the one side. And this is all the hair that we have left, so I'm just going to put it all on this side for now. <laughs> Look what a sexy hairstyle. Then I'm actually just going to clip this side since we have so little we have to get done now. You don't want to mix up your hair. So just clip that side. Because like this side doesn't all fall on this part, so this like falls over here, and when it's clipped, at least I know which pieces I need to curl. Yes, I know I'm using my other hand right now but this part's just easier to do just make sure you don't burn yourself if you like if you lost your glove or if you um don't have your glove i would keep your glove in a safe spot so you always have it because if you're burning yourself with this it really is gonna hurt okay so now we're done with that side and we just have some pieces to curl on this side so once again the outermost part i like to start off with so grab that section. Okay, so now we're done. I'm gonna shut this off. And of course, unplug it. Take the clip out of your hair and look at that sexiness. Like, I sent a picture to my sister yesterday because she's back home instead of at the dorms. And I sent a picture to my mom and they were like, you look like a completely different person. They were like, it's scary, but it looks really nice. That's what they said. So I'm just going to run my um, fingers through some of the pieces, especially at the ends because you don't want it to look too fake. And then a little bit on this side. Even though they don't really like to separate, they like to stay together. And this is our finished look, guys. So I hope you guys liked this video and this tutorial. And like I said, it's the 19 millimeter, um, 19 millimeter wand. I'm not gonna touch it because it's hot, but um, that's what it looks like. It's just really thin, see, compared to the size of my finger. So I really, really like this. This is not a sponsored video, guys. Um, I'm just doing this video just because no one has a 19mm on YouTube that I've seen of a video. They all have, like, the bigger barrel, so um, that's why I did a video, but it's not sponsored. I paid for that with my own money and everything. Um, they're not paying me to make this video, nothing like that. I bought this myself, I made this video myself, all opinions are my own, and all my, everything like that. So I hope you guys liked it, and like I said, it's finished look, it looks so, so pretty. I love it. I think I'll be curling my hair way too much now, but, um, I need to get a trim, hair trim anyway, so it's okay. I could damage my hair a little bit more before that, right? <laughs> Not really, but um, hope you guys liked it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.